we, we got the Pixel 6 already in the house here. This is the Pixel 6 right here. The screen looks amazing. I like it. This design looks like a raccoon or something, you know, like the black around the eyes and stuff. It feels kind of lightweight. It's hard to tell with this big ass thing on it, but it's good YouTube. Fresh rate looks pretty decent on this. Screen quality looks really good. Alright, no rotate, okay. Yeah, that's really nice. Ooh, screen looks so good. Really detailed and stuff. Really nice. This is the Pixel 6 Pro. So let's see. Pro versus the Pixel 6. It's really just a little bit bigger than the Pixel 6. But yeah, it feels nice and lightweight also. I like the full screen with no notch, just that tiny camera at the top. I wish Apple would stop it with these damn notches. Come on, Apple. Swipe gestures are the same on the iPhone and stuff. Let's go over to the, let's see what ESPN. I like the kind of curve on the side. It's kind of a nice touch. Yeah, this feels like a really nice phone. Super glossy on the back, so fingerprints will be kind of an issue on that, but yeah, this looks really nice. Screen quality is amazing on this. So in the normal camera modes, there's 0.7 ultra wide. Looks nice. There's also one, the normal wide. There's also two times zoom. And then there's four times zoom. Looks pretty good. All right, camera, selfie camera on the Pixel 6 Pro. Looks pretty good. The Pixel 6 is supposed to have better skin tones for people of color. So I'm curious if this will make me look less green because my skin, my Asian skin, <laughs> tends to look kind of green, but this looks really nice actually. I'm curious what kind of technology, let's see, try portrait mode. This does. Oh, it's, it's beautiful. Oh, there we go. Hey, that looks pretty good. Damn, looks like some studio lighting. Background blur does look kind of artificial, but you know. Let's see if we can edit this a little bit. Enhance. Damn, look at that. That looks really good. Like black and white. Color pop. That looks nice. 